softening at the pole to our touch is a great way to begin teaching the horse to give to our rein pressure later on. One, horse has to be comfy of standing in front. Two, the hand out to the side of the horse's face without touching him. And I'm feeding for central head position so that um, the horse is in the right place for the next time I put my hand out. And I'm trying to feed with the same hand I've put out. Number three, touch the cheek. So I do it with my left hand and then with my right hand. And I'm also feeding for a low relaxed head. Touching and click. Slice four, a gentle push on the cheek just to uh, get the horse to move the head over a tiny bit. Little push, click and treat. Should be clicking as the push is happening. So click and treat. Click and treat. Click as the horse is moving and treat. I'm going to do slice five where I lift up both hands either side of the horse's face, not touching. And number six, slice six is to touch both cheeks. So lift up both hands and place them on either side of her face. And click while my hands are actually on her face. Slice seven, I'm going to push the head to touch my other hand, which is out a little bit from her head. So I've got one hand out a little bit, and I'm pushing so that her head comes over to touch my other hand. And the click should be when we touch the other hand. So click right there as we make contact with the other hand. and click. Feeding for central head position and the head down. Click. The idea is to get the horse really loose in the pole eventually. Click. Click. Eight. And I'm going to rock her head to the left and the right. So we're going to get two touches. So I rock her to that hand, and then I rock her back to the other hand eventually. So I'm going to rock her to that hand, and then rock her back to the other hand, and back to that hand again. So that's the idea. You can see there's still a lot of stiffness and resistance. She's not totally cool with this at all. And you can tell that she actually needs a break. So I'm going to put a few pellets in her tray. Now the, we're going to start again, and the cue is just to put both hands on the side of her face. Now this time we're going to do three rocks. And my husband's mowing the lawn, so she's a little bit distracted. But that's okay. Just wait a moment, and then go one, two. And that's all she was able to give me before her head came up, so that was okay as well. We're going to go one, two, and that's pretty good. She's loosening up a little bit. It's really easy to feel when they're tight or when they're able to loosen up. And there her head comes up, so she's still pretty tense. Get four rocks this time. Two, three, four. She's relaxing into it a little bit more, so I gave her a triple treat just to break the intensity of the new learning. And then we're going to go back to it. Two. Three, four, five this time. One, two, three, four, five. And I'm starting to move, sway my body, and I think she took a little bit of modeling there. Two, three, four, five, six, six. Still a long way to go to get real relaxation, but uh, a lot of fun.